on the 2006 Kia Sedona and other Sedonas from other model years is a common problem underneath. Um, road salt can rust the coolant lines that go back to the rear heater. Uh, on mine, I checked them out. They were pretty rusty. I saw a small drip of coolant and when I pulled the pipes off, the, one of the pipes just broke right in half and you can see that. So it was basically ready to fail. Here's the original part. Um, you can buy these online or at your Kia dealer and basically what you want to do if you're getting rid of this pipe and getting rid of the rear, he rear heater function is to bypass the rear heater altogether otherwise you can replace it. First step is to cut these uh, pipes underneath the rubber part and cap them off so you can take off the full front section of pipes and bypass. So there's um, the capped rear section underneath the air <clears throat> intake you can remove that and you'll see uh, the T fitting that you should um, put a cap on that number three there there's uh, from the underside there's actually two of them and that'll send the water excuse me coolant straight from the um, engine block to the front heater core and back and it will totally bypass the rear system um, the rest of these pictures just show kind of the final steps of removing that tubing and as a tip uh, KiaTechInfo.com gives you all the repair instructions that you'll need for your for your Kia. I found it to be a great resource.